Hello everybody, it's Lisa from Lisa P. Crafts and I am back home from my three-week European vacation. And uh, yeah, it was fantastic, tiring, feet were killing me, ankles were killing me, knees were killing me, everything hurt. So much walking, but it was amazing. Except now I'm really far behind. I haven't done anything for October yet and it is Friday the 6th and I am just doing this one and I haven't even posted last week's yet. So anyways, I am going to do Halloween-ish type one. I am going to use this sheet of florals from Amber Planzer Day Fall Memories, which I believe is last year's because I didn't get any fall sticker books this year. And then this is just from like the dollar store stickers and I'm going to use the pumpkins and I think what I'm going to do is just a pumpkin patch across the bottom. So everything feels weird. I haven't done a spread in over a month, let alone record one. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to be very, I'm probably going to rip a bunch of stickers like I normally do. I'm going to change my mind a million times like I normally do. And yeah, that's, that's just me. Oh, and I forgot my glasses. Oh my gosh. Wouldn't you know it? I always forget my glasses and today is no exception. Okay. Got my glasses. Okay, so I'm gonna put that stick in here. So these three here are a little bit larger, so I'm gonna place those first. Where are my tweezers? There they are. And then I'm gonna go from there. I'm gonna add in the pumpkins. I have no idea what I'm gonna put on the top. I have not figured that out yet. And I have to remember to stay on camera. And I've got a wrinkle. Oh well, I'm not, to be honest, this week I've done absolutely nothing. We got back on Saturday and I have just been trying to get my sleep back in order, get my eating back in order. Yeah, try and get my body back in order because holy smokes, I've been very sore. We've been walking um, for hours and hours and hours every day and in Europe and my body just hurt when I came home. Plus, you know, a seven hour, just over seven hour flight from... London to Montreal, and then another three hour flight from Montreal to get home to Winnipeg. So yeah, hasn't been much fun. I can imagine being stuck on a plane, all stiff and not being able to move, not being able to really stretch. I did get up a few times to go to the bathroom, but yeah. And then the sleep is seven hours difference. So I am now trying to get that back. Okay, there we go. We've got the base done. So now I wanna stick pumpkins in here. I'm gonna start with the bigger ones. Oh, this one's bigger. And I can do two things. I can just stick them on top because the flowers are clear. I can also lift the flowers and have them kind of peeking out. So let's see. Um, tweezers are better. Let's just lift this one up. Let's 
see what it looks like if we hmm it's not great it work. Let's see if we can rub the clear. The thing is the clear sticker is noticeable. That's not too bad. Yeah. Meep, meep, meep. I just have to figure out where I'm going to put them. Need a bigger one in here. Let's move this side up. This is not working out exactly the way I want it to. I kind of was hoping I could get some of the branches over top. Um, knife. Cut that. Just cut this across. And rub that down. It's not too, too bad. I don't hate it, hate it. I'll do something like this. Just so that it looks like it's in the pumpkin patch, in with the flowers. I don't know. We're going with it though. I think what I'm gonna need to do is do some sticker surgery. Yay. that up take my little pumpkin stick him in like this hmm don't like this one I think it's the flower the problem is the flower And I have him sticking out from the flower. You know what? I'm going with it. <laughs> is there another? Is there? I'm trying to see some if there's different ones here. This one's a little bit smaller. Yeah, I can put him in here. I have to remember, I'm on camera. I do need to talk every once in a while. Let's see. Oh, jeepers. Jeepers creepers. <laughs> Don't ask. I haven't done one of these in a while. I'm a little goofy. I feel a little goofy doing it. I think I'm going to cut this piece off here. Pull that off. See, he can't look like he's floating in the air. Like, he needs to be kind of in there. So maybe I need... 
Oh yeah, those are the same. It looks like I only have three pumpkins styles here. This one, this one, and this one. There's just different sizes. So let's go with a bigger one. Yeah, he's gonna be the same. Come on, lift back up. Oh, I ripped the sticker. Big shocker. I said I was probably gonna end up ripping a bunch of stickers. Okay, so this flower needs to come off. I went through my paper. Sheesh. Again, been gone. <laughs> His whole face is covered up. just reattach a few pieces here. Just looking, just look in here, see. I kind of feel like maybe I could throw this one in here. Yeah, this piece looks ridiculous sitting there, I know. It's coming off. Nope, not using that one. Okay. Just use this one, uh, one more. Oop, rip that sticker. Let's put it in here. And just saying. Oh, I don't want to cover up the hole, I don't think. Okay, so let's just take this up. See what we got. I don't know that I love it, but I don't hate it. It needs, to me it feels like it needs a little more spooky, but I like spooky Halloween, not so much the cutie pie Halloween. I don't know what, why there would be a tombstone in a pumpkin patch. Mind you, why would there be flowers in a pumpkin patch? That doesn't make sense either. So we're just going to go with it. <laughs> okay. So I need to work another pumpkin in here somehow. Can I just do that? I feel like I need something behind it though. Maybe I can pull in like this. Let's see. Yay! 
Yeah, that works. That works. Like I said, I don't love it, but I don't hate it. I don't like the line right here, this line that's going on. Well, the one thing I can do is I can cut off this part. I can cut this little chunk off here. That will make the line a little bit smaller. All right. It a little less noticeable. Oh, I see what I did here. Ooh. I cut that flower a little bit. So I could probably do this. That coming out like that. Okay, so I do have this piece here, which is a little bit bigger. So I am going to try that. Yes, my helper cat is here. And yeah, they definitely missed us. They have been... Oh, that's upside down. I don't like upside down. I wonder, where's my pumpkin? Can I cut this? So what if I put like this piece up here? It's not too bad. You know what? I think I might just leave that. Bring the pumpkin in a little bit more. Uh, angled a bit more. Yeah, I'm just going to leave that. I am not going to be extremely fussy today because I have my currently, my monthly. I have to get last week's posted. I'm doing this week's. I need to do next week's. So yeah, a lot of spreads that I need to get done. So I'm not going to be crazy picky. Okay, so now we need some boxes. Okay, so... I pulled some purple and orange foil stickers. So I got the orange foil ones from Mojo Jojo Plans Autumn Boxes. There they are. And then I got the dark purple from Mojo Jojo Plans Jewel Tone Boxes. Right there. It's a little hard finding the exact colors that I wanted. A lot of the oranges are too bright. I wanted something a little darker. Okay, so the only thing that I have this week is I have Thanksgiving dinner. It is Thanksgiving on Monday the 9th, October the 9th in Canada. So I need a bigger sticker in there. I do have, it's Monday, October 9th is Thanksgiving, but I have Thanksgiving dinner on the 8th. So I need a bigger box to write that in and I make this box crooked. Oh, I hate redoing foil stickers. You know what? I'm just gonna go off a little. That's a little crooked. That looks better. And now the foil has creases in it because when you lift up foil stickers, they get little creases in them. But that's okay. Okay, so now I'm gonna put a big purple one on. Probably like right up in here. I am going to be like, I don't know, writing in things that I've already done. Like, um, come back from holidays, 
laundry, put everything away, you know, that kind of stuff. So let's put just a, you know what? Let's get a little header. Where did I put those boxes? Or boxes, books, 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 books. There it is. Let's get a foil header. I have got stuff everywhere on this table. And it doesn't help that I, my helper cat is sitting right there where I could put stuff. Seems crooked. Okay, header there, and then I just want to throw a couple other boxes on. header or do I just want to put in a purple box hmm you know what I think I'm just gonna put a purple box in uh, I'm gonna put a crooked purple box in Okay, good enough. Okay, so now what I wanted to try. So I took one of my pumpkins. Here, let me move this out of the way. And I cut out it just its teeth, like a slot. And what I want to do is make him look like he is eating one of my boxes. Like that. So, I put him, I put him up in here. And then I have, I messed this one up here. This one here could probably look like it's eating a pumpkin. Or I can just use the same sticker. Oh, facing the same way though. Oh, I didn't think this out. Maybe I take this purple sticker, or purple box off. <laughs> you can tell I'm a little bit off. Actually, I probably can't because I change my mind all the time, right? Okay, so let's cut out the teeth from this one. Okay. And then what we're going to do is lift it up. We're going to make it eat the spoil box here. which probably would have been easier to do before I put the box down. But again, off just a little bit. There we go. <laughs> oh, this looks so cute. Well, not cute, scary, but neat. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Okay, so I think I'm just going to do a couple, do I want them the same size? Does it matter that they're the same size as that one? Uh, yeah, a little bit. I feel like this purple one needs to be a bit bigger. So I don't really have 
a bigger purple. So I'm gonna bring in some black boxes. So I'm gonna put a black box in here. We'll add the orange one to it. And then I'm gonna bring a smaller black one in here, just so that I have black on both sides. Okay, I still have this purple header pulled out. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna stick it in here, like right in the middle of the box, and I'm going to write time in for dinner. So I'll write the info in here and I'll write the time in there just to kind of, I feel like, I kind of felt like these two boxes were sitting by themselves where there was a cluster. I don't know. Anyways, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, you can tell I haven't done one of these in a while. Okay, so I think I want to bring in something else. There's some bats on these sheets. So let's see what the bats look like. Yeah, I think a few of the bats. So like I said, this is just a dollar store sticker sheet. I liked it because it's kind of creepy. It is definitely creepy, but it's kind of real. More, a little more realistic, not cartoonish. Okay, so let's go, I can't remember, I think I got two sheets in one package, too. I have two sheets, I don't have the packaging anymore. So let's grab the bats. Okay, I lost a bat. Oh, he's on the back. Okay, so these ones are the same, so he will fit. Let's make it look like he's landing on this box. So let's cut some of the white away. Okay, so I cut some of the white away. So make it look like he's gonna land on this box here. Okay, and then... Hmm thing is there's only two different kinds of bats so I've got two small ones and two big ones so maybe I'll just throw this one down here even though like they're the same but oh, all my sticker pieces fell onto my page and let's get the bigger one your one in here. See, and this one's the same. Same as that one. I could put him over here and cover up. Yeah, let's do that. Cover up the white out. Sorry, bat. Cutting your wing off. Do I want it to look like there's another bat somewhere? No. That looks weird. <laughs> Just looks weird. Okay, so we have a little bit of flowers left. So let's... I want to put... what I'm going to do is put flowers going in the side panel because I really don't know what else. Oh my gosh, I can't get these off. I really don't know what else to put in the side panel. Like I don't need, I don't need any lists. I don't need, I guess I could put quote. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll put a quote in there. I guess that's going there. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's just weird, Phil. Okay, we'll hold on to these couple little pieces here. I may want to stick them, you know, like this maybe. And get another one. I don't like putting my flowers upside down. Like that. I feel like I need to maybe cut. And I'm back to picking up the sheet of stickers rather than leaving it down and pulling it up. I'm doing this, trying to get them to go, which is the hardest thing to do. So let's add in a little bit in here. What if I come right off of here? Yeah, that works for me. Did it again, picked it up. This kind of almost feels like a bit of a corner piece. You know, like that it could go on the corner. Sure, let's do that. Okay, last one. So in the... Um, Fall Memories book from Amber Planter Day, where I got these flower stickers. You only get one sheet of each uh, sticker. So that I, this is all I have, and I definitely need flower up in here. That is for sure. And do I just throw it down? Yeah, let's just throw it down. Okay, so now let's just find some savings. So here's the problem with doing spookier spreads. It's hard to find quotes. I put a spell on you, stay spooky, you give me the creeps. Even if I put you give me the creeps, the actual like lettering is not very spooky. Spooky season, that's not horrible. I like this. I am the shadow on the moon at nights, filling your dreams to the brim with fright. That's Oogie Boogie from Nightmare Before Christmas. And I think I like the font on this one. Let's see. And sorry, Oogie Boogie, but I don't like putting the, I don't like putting the names on. So let's see how this works. That works for me. Yeah, right in here. And I know I haven't done this, but I think I am going to white out this line. I haven't did, like I left all the lines everywhere else. So if you haven't seen, I just use a jelly roll. Number 10 is the best. Okay. I've got my big fat fingers in the way. I can't see where I'm putting it. And the eye is going down wrong. Okay. Holy smokes, get it, get it going here, girl. I'm just gonna put a 
little bit more on here. I am dabbing at it. I find sometimes dabbing works best. There. I am the shadow on the moon at night, filling your dreams to the brim with fright. That works for me. Okay, so there's this haunted house one, but I think I'm gonna cut it and just use the haunted part. I like the font on this. I think the font would go, goes, yes. See, I think the font goes with it. I'm kind of, this could go anywhere, really. Let's put it here. There we go. Okay, so I went back up to my stash and found these sticko stickers. I'll do this so you can actually see them. And I think the pumpkin, and I think I might use the Happy Halloween. I was kind of debating on putting Happy Halloween on here. Oop, sorry for the noise. But I am gonna use the pumpkin. And I am going to put him right in here, I think. There or there? Right here. Put that in there. And then the Happy Halloween. I could put the Happy Halloween there. I was thinking of putting the Happy Halloween, cutting it and putting it in here. However, I don't know how well that's actually going to fit. Is the Halloween going to fit in here? Well, you know what? I'll just go over a little bit. I'm going to go over a little bit crooked. Definitely being crooked today. Okay, and then I'll just stick this. Do I like it like that? Yeah, I think so. And I think that's it. I like it. I love, actually, you know what? I love it. I love, love spooky Halloween. Love, love, love spooky Halloween. Okay, so I'll give you a close-up look. So if you are new here, I do a lot of different styles. I'll use kits and I use <laughs> stickers from my stash, obviously. Use dollar store stuff and scrapbook paper, inking, stamping, lots of different things. So check out my videos and please subscribe. Hit like if you like this one. I love it actually, I wish it you could see it in person with the gold foil. It, it's really cool looking. And what else? Oh, share with your friends. Please and thank you. Share with your planner community. All right, everybody. Have a wonderful day. And I'll try really hard to get my October stuff out and get caught back up. And missed you guys. Bye-bye.